A hydroelectric power station transforms potential energy into electric energy. Water from a fall or a dam drives the water turbine and a generator. Let us examine the parts. First, we have the generator at the top. The water turbine is connected to the generator via a rubber o ring. Water from a waterfall, in our case from a tap, enters the water generator via the tubing. We can see two electric wires extending from the generator. Attach the red banana connector in the socket in front of the ammeter and attach the other wire to the copper band behind the ammeter. The ammeter has two wires attached to it. Place one of them into the hole in the red banana connector and the other one into the light bulb socket. Now open the top and observe the reading on the ammeter and watch the bulb. Next, move the banana connector from the bulb socket to the electric motor socket and observe how it turns. Then, move the banana connector to the buzzer and notice the noise it generates. When we have an excess of electricity, we can store the electric energy at a fall or a dam in a rechargeable battery. Transfer the wire to the socket connected to the rechargeable battery and observe the current. After five minutes have elapsed, Disconnect the generator by removing the two banana connectors from their sockets and close the tap. We can now use the stored electricity. Plug one wire from the emitter into the battery socket and the other to all three consumers, the bulb, the electric motor, and the buzzer. The buzzer is activated only if the current flows in a particular direction. If the buzzer does not make a noise, reverse the connections.